Hi there, Flat Cap Chef here, and I'm just going to show you how to make uh, brandy or rum butter, uh, depending on your taste. This is about the simplest thing you're going to make. Uh, you can do it two ways. You can use soft brown sugar to make a brown sugar version, which I prefer, or you can do it with icing sugar, uh, if you want the sort of whiter, lighter, sweeter version of it, uh, that you might put on mince pies, perhaps, or on a Christmas pudding. Um, you'll need the same quantity of unsalted butter. This is at room temperature and I've just popped it in a microwave for 20 seconds just to soften it up a bit more. And then of course your uh, your drink of choice, in this case it's uh, brandy for me, and uh, a beater. Now you can do it by hand but it's a bit tricky to do it by hand, uh, so, so it takes quite a long time. So straight in with the butter, which has been softened. One, this, this is 250 grams, so it's the same amount of butter to sugar. You can just vary the amounts, always the same uh, in terms of uh, you know, equal. And uh, I've just, that's just over a mug. Drop that in on top. And then uh, I'm just going to get these in here and start beating it. So we'll start it off and then we'll come back uh, when I'm a bit further on. Okay, so this has taken about two minutes and uh, you'll see now it's smoother. Mm. Yep, and slightly paler. So now this is the point where we add in our uh, rum or in my case, brandy. Mm. So I'm gonna put in about four tablespoons, depending on how much, how boozy you want it too much in it, it won't uh, set again so now we'll start another whisk low speed to start with just to get it in there oh, it smells amazing already make sure it's properly incorporated you'll find it when you leave it in the fridge for a little while um, the alcohol will just separate out a little bit but that's absolutely fine it stores in the fridge for quite a long time so it's just basically sugar and butter Added. This particular one, I uh, I love this. It's just on fresh bread, spread on fresh bread. It's just amazing. And you see the alcohol is turning it a bit paler again now. And you have a taste. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, that's not enough. I need to put some more in. I'm going to put another three in and then we'll do some more whisking then I'll be back. Okay so that's now done um, and all you need to do is just, uh, I've got my pot here, just take it out, drop it into the pot, you can store it as I said in your fridge, which should be lovely and if you want to see more then just subscribe uh, and it just means it's free, you just get notifications when I post new videos, typically once or twice a week, maybe more. Uh, and uh, then there's the website www.theflatcapchef.com, all one word. Uh, and I'll be back soon.